Hi guys, my name is Sabine and welcome to another video. Today I will be talking to you guys about gift ideas for book lovers. Okay, so we are in the middle of November right now and if you are from the Netherlands, just like me, Sinterklaas is just around the corner but for most people we're talking about Christmas and I mean we all need to get gifts. If you have someone in your friend group who is a book lover, I think I have the perfect ideas for this. Some of them might be very obvious but I mean for the people who do not know a lot about book-ish things then this video is for them. So let's start off with the most obvious thing that you can give a book lover but I am 100% sure that every single person who loves books <laughs> will love this present. Oh my god, what will it be? Books! Oh my god. <laughs> this is probably something that you wouldn't have come up with yourself because it is so unique to think about. I mean, look at me. I have so many books, but I still want more. So um, I think that if you could give books like that gift idea a little bit more of a personal touch, maybe you could find more information about certain books that speak to you personally. And then when you let the person know, okay, this book, I think it um, would be very interesting for myself. So that is why I bought it for you maybe that person is already like, okay, he or she put more thought into the bookish gift. One thing that might be very handy to do when you are giving a book to a book lover is check um, whether or not maybe this person already has this book on his or her wish list. So a lot of the people have Goodreads, so you can maybe add them to that. I hope that you guys meet on a regular basis and you can check maybe if that person has that book that you want to buy for them in their bookshelf because everyone loves getting books but when you get a book twice it's always like sad life but if you are very unsure of what book you want to give to that person you could also give them a gift card to either like amazon or book depository or maybe to your local bookstore but that is the most obvious gift out of the way my second recommendation would be to give something to put on their shelves i don't know you can kind of see it from a distance but i have lots of things on my shelves one of the main things that i collect which i really like to put as a decoration on here are these Funko Pops. And I think that if you have seen a lot of the booktube videos, a lot of people have them as well. So these are basically just plastic dolls, I guess, which are inspired by TV shows or cartoons. Sometimes I think books. I mean, like they have Harry Potter, but that's also like based on the movies. Um, these are, for instance, from Stranger Things, which I absolutely adore. I think a lot of book lovers are also fangirls, fanboys um, from different TV shows, so have a look at what things they are obsessed with. And I can guarantee you a lot of the times they do have Funko Pops for that. What else can you put more on shelves? You could maybe even make like a really cute photo frame like with the two of you so they can put it on their shelves. Also something which is very pretty on a bookshelf is plants. So I'm trying to uh, take care of plants more than I did in the past. I'm succeeding quite okay right now, but plants always make a bookshelf look a little bit more lively. If you are a book lover, a booktuber, a bookstagrammer, and you don't have this, <laughs> kind of feels like you are not legit part of the community, and that is fairy lights. Can you see them in the back? I think that almost every book lover has fairy lights because it just looks so cute and cozy on your shelves. So I don't have it on my shelves in particular, but giving fairy lights is always, I think, a success. Then my third gift idea is scented candles. I have a special shelf just for my bookish candles. They are quite a lot to be honest. I haven't checked on the Etsy shop if they still sell this. I hope so because I'm running low on this candle. But this one is by Book and Nook. It's called Be Our Guest and it is a rich, rich, rush, a rich and delicious creme brulee scented candle. This is very, very intense, but it smells so good. I really love my candles to smell very sweet and more on like the vanilla cookie kind of side. But I've also gotten like so many candles in bookish boxes. So just look up on Etsy like certain companies that create scented candles. And I think that a lot of people will enjoy a nice smelling candle as well. Next up, something that is essential to have when reading a book, or at least it's not essential, but a lot of people use it. And that is a bookmark. <laughs> One of the designs that I really like are these um, bookmarks by Ink and Wonder Designs. I believe that this is an Australian company. Australian. <laughs> <laughs> 
Jij bent stom. Ga maar gewoon weg. Nee, ik kan geen video's opnemen. Jij gaat me altijd belachelijk maken. Ik maak het even op je en dan weet ik dat jij zo gelijk zo. Jij bent stom. <laughs> One of these bookmarks is really nice. They always have like a wooden base which they print like a really nice design on. Of course, I need to plug in some people that I know that I want to support. Brit from uh, Basically Brit, she is really active on Etsy. She makes amazing bookmarks. So I have two of hers right here, but she has many, many more in her store. So definitely check that out. So this one says, books let me escape the real world and this one is life's full of sunshine but she has ones which are more aimed towards like Christmas right now so really good one if you want to stay into like the Christmassy theme and on that note um, some book lovers really like to decorate their room with prints as well so prints are also really great things to get I have um, in my, like my special reading nook I am trying to decorate the whole wall with prints and one of my very very good friends Leora from book with Leo check out her channel she just started it and she makes really great videos um, she also just started her Etsy shop and she has made really pretty prints this one is just absolutely stunning um, plus also really cool interesting designs and they're just really lovely to decorate your room with plus they can also have um, more of like bookish designs because these are obviously not specifically for people who love books other companies create amazing prints as well which are aimed towards uh, bookish quotes or maybe characters are on it or whatever something that is a little bit more special maybe to give and which is definitely a little bit more expensive is a bookish subscription box there are a lot of boxes which have like a monthly theme and um, they have like a book in there with some special items as well. I've had a subscription to a Fairy Loot in the past and I think their boxes are really great. They've definitely put books in their boxes which I didn't know of before so that is amazing but they are all I believe fantasy books sometimes maybe a little bit more sci-fi but you also have Owl Crate. You have uh, also special boxes for Harry Potter lovers. They do not include a book but they have a lot of Harry Potter themed items so for instance you have the Accio box I believe what it's called. Getting someone a box which is like aimed towards book lovers would be amazing as well if you have a little bit more of like money to spend. And the last gift that I want to recommend to you guys are Bookish Blankets by Emposia. I cannot show you this on the whole frame so I will put in a clip of where I wear the blanket and show you what it looks like. This blanket I got from Emposia so they send it to me for free so thank you to Emposia for sending me this really nice blanket. These are really nice soft Cozy blankets, really great for the winter time, and you can wear them as a rope, so you kind of look like a Harry Potter student, which I believe we all want to look like. You can just walk around the house still wearing the blanket. So yeah, they feel really nice and soft, both on the outside and the inside, which is of course really important. They have really great designs. I especially love the design which says like bibliophile on it. I think it looks really great but they have many more designs. Together with Emposia we have teamed up for a special Christmas giveaway so you can enter that in order to win one of these really nice blankets. So I will leave a link in the description bar down below on how you can enter the giveaway. It is open until November 22nd and a restock of the blankets will be up after November 23rd. So if you want to buy it for yourself I also also have a special code to use which will be right here in the screen right now and you can get 10% off off of your blanket if you buy it after November 23rd plus I will also get a small portion of the price of the blanket just so you know if your book loving friend boyfriend girlfriend whatever doesn't have a nice blanket to stay cozy with and read a book I would definitely recommend the Imposia blanket. So these were all the gift ideas that I wanted to mention to you guys. If you have ideas for yourself let me know in the comments down below then we can all share our ideas. If you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and you can subscribe to my channel by clicking somewhere here on the screen or on the button down below. You guys can also follow me on all of my different social media pages because I'm a booktuber. Of course I have Goodreads but I also have Snapchat, Instagram plus an email address and links to those will also be in the description bar down below. Again, thank you so much for watching and I hope that I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!